so whatever works for you. Close your eyes. Bring your spine, head and neck in one straight line. Relax your breath and body. Bring your awareness to your breath. And let's resolve. Keep our awareness throughout the practice. Join your hands in Namaskar Mudra at the heart center. We'll say three Omkaras. We'll do the invocation prayer now. Feel free to join me. exercises. So stand up on your yoga mat. We'll start with some neck rotation. So bring your head, chin to your chest, rotate from right, right to left. Inhale as you go up. Exhale when you down. Two more rounds. Inhale. And we go up, exhale, bring it down. Inhale, and we go up, exhale, bring it down. Let's switch the part. Inhale, up and back, exhale, bring it down. Two more rounds. Keep your eyes closed. If you feel dizzy, let's start the practice. And the rest of rotation now. So stretch your arms in front. Lock your thumbs inside your finger. Make a fist and rotate in one direction. We'll do five rounds of this. Three, 
Five. Other direction. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. So the shoulder rotation now. So bring your fingers on your shoulder. Bring your elbows in front. Touching like this. Inhale and take your elbows back. Up and back. Exhale, bring it down and forward. We'll do five rounds of this. Two. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, and the last round in this direction. Inhale, exhale. We'll rotate in opposite direction. So inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Three more rounds. So when you take your elbows back, just keep your elbows come together. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, and one last time. Inhale, exhale. Put your hands on your hips. We'll do some hip rotation. Your feet about shoulder width apart. Inhale, exhale. Inhale as you move forward. Exhale as you bring your hip back. We'll do three more rounds. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, and one last round in this direction. Let's rotate in opposite direction. Inhale, exhale. Stop the practice. Bring your hands on your knees, just above your knees. Feet together, and we'll do knee rotations now, five times in each direction. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Three more rounds in this direction. Four. And five. Change the direction. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. And come up. Now it's time to address our ankle joints. So stretch your leg in front. Flex your ankle, extend, press, extend, flex, extend, and make a big circle with your toes. One, two, three, four, and five. Change the direction. Five, four, three, two, one, other leg, extend, flex, flex, extend, flex, extend, flex, and change, rotate in one direction. Let's change the direction. Two, three, four, five. Now we are using up our joints. We'll go over some stretches. So the first stretch we'll do is Ardhita Chakrasana stretches. 
So we are side stretches. Raise your hands to your shoulder level. Raise your right hand up and bring your left hand down. And stretch yourselves towards the left side. Bend on left side. Still giving yourself nice stretch on the right hand side. Let's do the opposite. We'll do this in a speed. With a fluid motion, continuous with fluid motion. Okay. Let's begin. We'll do 10 rounds of it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And stop the practice. We'll do ankle stretch breathing. We'll bring your hands in front. Inhale, bring your hands up and heels up. Exhale, hands and heels down. We'll do 10 rounds of this in a continuous fluid motion with the speed. So, Stop the practice. Now we'll do last stretches. We'll do spinal twist. So bring, raise your hands to your shoulder level. Bring your left hand at the heart center. And twist toward the right. Exhale and twist. Look at your right palm as you twist right. Bring your Inhale and bring your hands to the center. We'll just twist on the left hand side now. Exhale and twist left. Look at the palm as you go back. We'll do this in a fluid motion with the speed. So we'll focus on exhalation. Inhalation will happen passively. Exhale, 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 exhale. And keep looking at the hand that's going back. That will give you a nice twist on your torso. Turn around. And let's start the practice. You can bring your hands on your knees and we can do walkability. So inhale through your nose. Exhale out to your mouth. That will bring your breath to normalization very quickly. When your breath is strong, come to the sticky starting position for the standing asana. We'll go for standing asana now. First asana we will do is three point asana. So take your feet about three feet apart. <clears throat> three cone asana or triangle pose is a sideways stretch. Inhale and raise your hands up to the shoulder level. Exhale and bring your left hand down to your left foot. And right hand is pointing towards the ceiling. You make sure your pelvis is not leaning back. Push your pelvis forward. That will make sure that it's in start side stretch and not a front stretch. Stay there and breathe normally for five, four, Three, two, one. Inhale and thumb up. Exhale, bring your hands down and bring your feet together. We'll do the same 
in other duration. So bring your feet about three feet apart. Raise your hand up. Inhale. Exhale and bend down. Right palm touching the right foot. Left palm pointing towards the ceiling. Try to open up your chest towards the ceiling and look at your left palm. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Inhale and come up. Exhale, bring your hands down and feet together. Turn in Shukila Tarasan. Close your eyes. Bring your awareness to your breath. Observe the sensations in your body. Take a two deep breath. We'll do partial Konasan now. So again, bring your feet about three to three and a half feet apart. We inhale and raise your hands to your shoulder level. Point your left toe towards the left. Stretch your upper body towards the left. And bring your knee to a 90 degree angle. Once you are there, exhale and bring your left palm down next to your left foot and place it down on the floor. Try to push your pelvis down so you get a nice 90 degree angle and a good stretch in your pelvis. Your right hand is up, pointing towards the ceiling. And look at your right palm. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Inhale. Then come up. Exhale. Bring your hands down and feet together. We'll do the same on the other side. Bring your feet apart, three to three and a half feet. Inhale and raise your hands to your shoulder level. Point your right foot towards right. Stretch your upper body and lean towards right. Bring your right knee to a 90 degree angle. Exhale and place your right palm next to your right foot. Bring your pelvis down. Left, point, left palm pointing towards the ceiling. Look at your left palm. Stay there for five, four, three, Two, one. Whenever you are in a final pose, you're not holding your breath. You're breathing loudly. Inhale and come up. Exhale. Bring your hands down. And feet together. Come to the resting position. Shitil Tarasana. Observe your breath and moment of energy and sensations in your body. Relax there for two breaths. We'll go for some sitting asana now. First one we'll do is Paridrata. 
Canu şirkatın Head to knee goes. The podium, podium, oh. Come to Nidhar Dasan City first. This is the starting position for all the sitting asanas. If you can see, your legs are not relaxed. Let me engage. And you are making a 90 degree angle with your upper body and your lower body. Hands by your hips. Back straight and erect. From here, pull your left leg. Bring your left heel to the perineum. Right leg is straight. And engage. Inhale and raise your hands up. Face your upper body to the front or towards the leg that is folded. As you exhale, bend down towards your right leg and try to grab your right toe. Keep bending with each exhalation. Try to look towards the ceiling. Chest is also facing up. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, come up. Exhale, bring your hands down. We'll do the same on the other side. The council very much has to be. I will change my direction so you can see that. This time, bend your right knee, bringing your right heel to the perineum. Left leg is straight. Face your upper body towards the leg that is folded. Inhale and raise your hands up. As you exhale, bend and grab your left toe with the left palm. Exhale and keep bending down. Try to grab your right left toe with your right hand. Your head comes out between both your arms and facing towards the ceiling. Chest is also opened and facing towards the ceiling. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Inhale. Exhale, bring your hands down. And both the legs in the bathroom. Rest here in Shitty Legalasana. So feet apart, hands apart, fingers pointing back. It's a reclining pose, not like a Legalasana city. And you can drop your hand back. You may close your eyes. Watch your breath and changes in your body. Rest there for two breaths. We'll now go for Purvo Patsana. Incline plane pose. So we'll start with the Dandasana Siddhi again. Bring your hands behind your back, shoulder width apart, firmly press your palm on your mat, 
Inhale and you start lifting your upper body, your hips and your shoulders rising up. Bring them in line with your spine. Firmly ground your foot on your mat. You can drop your head back. And stay here for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale and bring your head down to gently. Slowly bring your head up in line with your spine. And come. To Shiti Udhanakun. Relax here for two breaths. Observe the changes in your breath and body and state of your mind. Now we'll go for some pronasana. So pronasana, you will lie down on your stomach. First one will do is Ardha Sharabhasana. So come to the starting position for pronasana. Hands straight out in front. Legs together. Forehead resting on the mat. From here, bring your hands under your thighs, palm facing up. Chin is resting on the mat. Inhale and raise your both legs up as high as it can go. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, bring your legs down and raise your palm. You can rest in Lokarasana. Watch your breath and change it in the body. <clears throat> Next asana we do is Dhanurasana. So come to the starting position again. Arms stretch out in front. Head resting on the floor. Inhale. Come up and grab your foot. With your palms, bend your legs from the knee. That will bring your feet closer to your palms. Once you're there, inhale, raise your upper body up and raise your lower body up. Bring your thighs off the ground. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Release gently and you can rest in Makarasana again. <clears throat> Observe the changes in your breath, in your body, and in the state of the mind. Now we'll go for the fine asanas. So lay down on your back. Lay down on your back. Come 
come to a standing position, hands by your hips, feet together. First asana we'll do here is Ardha Halasana. Ardha Halasana. So inhale, start raising your legs up. 30 degree, 45 degree, 60 degree, and bring all the way to the 90 degree angle. Your hands are on the floor. Same position as we started. Legs are in the 90 degree angle with your upper body. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. With the exhalation, slowly start bringing your legs down, inch by inch. And control the bend. Relax in Savasana. Legs apart. Hands apart. Palm facing ceiling. Observe the changes in your body. From here, we can try going to a full halasan. Okay. So, okay. You might have to. One die. Oh. So come to the side of the wish. Feet together, hands by your hips. Come to Ardha Kalasan first, what we just did before. So bring the legs up, raising them to the 90 degree angle. Now, slowly from here, you will start raising your upper body as well. Bring it in one straight line. Exhale and start coming to the table top. Keep it hanging and bring your feet on the floor. Bring your hands down on the mat. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. In here, bring your legs down straight. So I can show them that. Bring them down slowly. Bring your body down inch by inch, gently, without any jerk. And rest in Shavasana. Observe the changes in your breath and in your body. Whenever you're ready, we'll move on to the next asana. Last asana of supine asana, which is a complementary asana for halasana. 
So come to the starting position. Hold your knees. And bring your thighs towards your chest. And hug your legs, interlacing your fingers like this. Exhale. Start raising your upper body up. And head towards your knees. Continue exhaling. And bring your nose to your knee. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Inhale and release your upper body and your legs. Down. Rest in Savasana. Observe any changes in the breath and in your body, your state of your mind. From here, we'll go on to DRT, deep relaxation technique. So lay down in Savasana. You can continue to lay down in Savasana. Come in a most comfortable position for your body. Legs apart, arms apart, arm facing towards the feeling. Relax your neck. Close your eyes. Bring your attention to your toes. Wiggle your toes. And relax them. Bring your attention to your foot. Relax the sole of your foot. Bring your awareness to your ankle joints. Relax your ankle joints. Bring your attention to your shin, to your calf muscles, and relax your shin and calf muscles. Pull up your kneecaps. Bring your attention to your knee joints and relax your knees. Bring your attention to, to the thighs. Bring your attention to all the upper thigh muscles and lower thigh muscles. So your hamstrings and quads. Relax your thighs. Bring your attention to your hip. Relax your hip joints. Bring your attention to your glute muscles. And relax your glute muscles. Slowly bring your attention to your back. Lower back, middle back, upper back, and your cervical.
Relax all the muscles in your back. Bring your attention into your spinal cord. Relax each word you bring at a time, starting from your number, starting from your sacral, number, thoracic, and cervical. Relax your each what you bring at a time. Bring your attention to your abdomen. Observe the breath. Observe the rise and fall of your abdomen as you inhale and exhale. Relax. Your abdomen. Bring your attention to your chest. Relax your chest. Observe your chest falling up, going up. And falling down as you inhale and exhale. Bring your attention to your shoulder joints. Relax your shoulder joints. Bring your attention to your fingers. Wiggle your fingers. Relax the palm. Bring your attention to your wrist. And relax your wrist. Let go of any tension. Bring your attention to your forearm. Relax your forearm. Bring your attention to your elbows. Relax your elbow joints. Bring your attention to the biceps and triceps. And relax your biceps and triceps. Move your neck side to side. And let go of any tension in your neck. Relax in your neck. Bring your attention to your cheeks. Chin, nose, eyelids, eyebrows, forehead, temple. Squeeze your face and relax. Relax all the facial muscles. Bring your attention to your skull. Relax top of your skull, front of your skull, back of your skull. Relax your skull. Let's enhance this relaxation 
by chanting Omkara. Inhale. Stay there for a couple of breaths. Whenever you are ready, come towards the flag, left side, it's the flag. Hold your knees and bring them on top of each other. Rest your right arm on the floor, pushing yourself with the help of your left arm, slowly come up to the right position. Keeping your eyes closed. We'll go for some primary now. So come to any meditative position, Ardha Padmasana, Padmasana, Sukhasana, or you can sit in Vajrasana also. So First to pranayam, that we will do is Bhastrika. If you can come in Vajrasan, you can come. That's the best position. So, bring your hands to your shoulder level. Lock your thumb inside your fingers and make a fist. By your shoulders. As you inhale, place your hands up and open your palm. Spread your fingers. As you exhale, make a fist again and bring it down to your shoulder level. We'll do this with four foot. Inhalation and exhalation. We'll do 10 rounds of it. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. When you're done, stop the practice. Bring your hands down. Observe the changes in your breath and the state of your mind. Next pranayam we'll do is Nari Shuddhi. If you come to Sukhasan, or the Padmasan, or Padmasan. Hold a Gyan Mudra with your left hand. And hold a Nasika Mudra with your right hand. Close your right nostril, keeping, keeping your spine at the neck in one line. Make sure your head does not lean on either side and you are not hunched from the back. Spine, neck, and head in one straight line. 
Follow your right nostril. Press your right nostril with your thumb. Start with the exhalation from left nostril. Inhale through the left nostril. And close your left nostril with the ring finger and the pinky. And exhale out to the right nostril. Breathe in through the right nostril. And breathe out through the left nostril. Breathe in through the left nostril. And breathing out to the right. Making sure exhalations are longer than inhalation. And these are not forceful exhalation or inhalation. They are very gentle. Inhale to right. Exhale to left. We'll do 10 more rounds of it. Go on your seat. We are switching the nostril after each inhalation. And using tongue to close the right nostril, using ring finger and pinky to close the left nostrils. Index finger and middle finger pointing up. Last time. Start with the exhalation from the left nostril. Bring your right hand down. On your knees, holding your chin on top, keeping your eyes closed. Bring your awareness to your breath. Observe any changes in your breath or in the state of your mind. Now, last pranayam we do is boundary. Keeping your eyes closed. Find neck, head in one straight line. Close your ears with your thumb. Put your index finger on the eyebrows, middle finger and ring finger on the bridge of the nose. 
and pinky goes down on your cheeks. Uh, I'm sorry, on the chin. Place your middle finger and ring finger very gently on the bridge of your nose. Don't press. Just keep it lightly, very lightly over there. Inhale. And as you exhale, we'll make a nagara, touching the tip of the tongue on the hard palate. So inhale. Make a bumblebee sound for a nagara as you exhale. For the two more hours of it, inhale. Inhale and release your hands. Bring them on facing up on your thighs. Keep your eyes closed. Observe the vibrations in your head region. Observe the changes in your breath, in your body, and in the state of the mind. We'll close the session with one omkara followed by Shanti Mantra. Bring your palms together in Namaskar Mudra at the heart center. Stay the Shanti Mantra. Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Niramaya Sarve Bhadrani Vashyantu Makashchitu Khabhavare Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Keeping your eyes closed. Take your hands behind your back. Hold your right wrist with your left palm. Inhale and slightly lean back. Drop your head back. Exhale and bring your forehead to the floor and go down to all the divine yoga gurus. Inhale and come up to the upright position. Release your hands, rub your palms. and massage your face, gently pet your face. 
your neck, shoulder, and your arms. Look down and with few blinks, gently open your eyes. Namaste.